Dr. Jean-Marc Voyadsis, a neurosurgeon at Southern Maryland Hospital Center, is performing a laminectomy to treat lumbar stenosis, a narrowing of the canal within the spinal column that houses and protects the spinal nerves. With the patient lying face down and asleep under general anesthesia, Dr. Voyadsis makes a small incision in the patient's back using x-ray guidance to locate the precise area of the disease. Dr. Voyadsis then uses a series of tubular dilators to create a narrow working corridor through the patient's back. The tubular dilators allow him to access the stenosis without damaging supporting structures of the spine, such as the surrounding muscles and ligaments. Using a surgical microscope, Dr. Voyadsis then performs a laminectomy by removing the bony wall of the narrowed spinal canal. This is performed with a high-speed drill and a series of surgical instruments that are deployed through the working channel. Kerosene rangiers are used to carefully remove the thickened ligaments within the canal that are causing the nerve compression. After confirming that he has successfully achieved a complete decompression of the nerves within the spinal canal, Dr. Voyadsis removes the working channel and closes the small incision. The procedure takes about an hour. Patients usually experience an immediate reduction in leg pain and are able to go home within several hours after surgery.